This is practice it exercise 4.5 POW. Write a method named POW that accepts a base and an exponent as parameters and returns the base raised to the given power. For example, the call POW34 returns 3 times 3 times 3 times 3 or 81. Do not use the math.pow method in your solution. Assume that the base and exponent are not negative. So, with our method, we do have to return an integer because we're returning a base raised to this exponent and there shouldn't be any decimals involved. And we have to accept the base and the exponent as our parameter. Now, another way to look at exponents, uh, we'll use the example given in the problem description. 3 to the power 4. Another way to look at 3 to the power 4 is just 3 being multiplied 4 times. In other words, we're just going to be multiplying the base exponent amount of times. And we could just basically just do this with a for loop. We make it less than exponent and we add up by 1 each time. This for loop is going to run exponent a lot of times and we want that every time uh this for loop runs we want to just do times three basically and we need a variable to do that so i'll just create like product and we actually cannot make this equal to zero because if we're just going to multiply something by zero it's just gonna like make it zero and when we return the answer it's gonna be zero so we do have to make it equal to one because when we're doing multiplication anything times one is itself that is the identity property so the product is gonna be itself times three or not times three the base times the base and that should work we could return our product And that is the solution without using the math.pow solution. So I hope this helped you and have a great day.